Oh, you're going to get robbed real soon. Say fat chops. You got the time? Or did you eat your pocket watch? Bug off, you little shit. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Come here, you little guinea bastard. Why would you even try to catch him? He should know that he's not a runner. <laughs> No, he's not even a walker anymore. A man has made me an offer. Of what nature? Financial? Domestic? Sexual? Yes. All of the above. <laughs> Will he marry you? I wouldn't think so. The various words for that sort of a woman, none of them are flattering. He'll provide, ma'am. Does Mrs. Schroeder need her approval or why is she even coming to her? Or does she just need somebody to say, You go, girl. Go get him. Be his whore. I gather you haven't made it up to Saratoga. How'd you know where it was? I have a crystal ball, Charlie. You know that. I've been waiting for a report on Mr. Dominey. I can't really speak to that now. I wouldn't think so, considering the company you've been keeping. And with his wife right now. Or does he even know all of that? No, you're not, Charlie. You're with his mother. <laughs> Did he just send a second guy to Atlantic City who stalks Lucky or what? Luciano. Is he still hanging around? I'll give you three to one. He's either behind this or knows who is. I got other fish to fry besides him. Well, fry them already. Some guinea pissant gets the idea that he... Knock, goddammit. I did. Well, knock like a man. <laughs> knock like a German, goddammit. No prisoners. Are you fucking crazy? Over there, you never played Five Finger Filet? We did. <laughs> I was just saying. We were more interested in winning the war. Go ahead. For old times. Johnny's coming. <laughs> Wuss. The report I mentioned in my wire. Sure, I had planned to mail it. Well, you certainly have plenty of stamps. Good observation, my friend. <laughs> Darmody and an unnamed accomplice executed five men. Then Thompson pinned the murders on Hans Schroeder. What is this obsession with the Schroeder character? You requisitioned the immigration file on his wife? You should get rid of that little guy who's constantly hanging around your office. Sonny? Leave him. He's in his own world. Fucking kid. <laughs> you know, I may not talk Italian, but I know what stupido means. <laughs> but you don't know if she was talking about you. Getting from mother, make for a wife and a dumbbell for a son. Don't call him that. You like your eggs, honey? I told you, he's a dopey little bastard. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bad shot. I got it. I got it. I got it. He's deaf. Mystery solved. Something vampy. And sheer. The cutout right here. Hmm. <laughs> I want to see what it looks like. On her. Why on her? How does that help you? You're saggy. <laughs> You've had children. Yeah, such a shame. You look like the kitchen help. He doesn't seem to mind. You don't know very much, do you? Wait a minute. She actually knows? About them? What? How? A raggedy man would come round every spring with a little bantam rooster. He trained it to peck out the mountains of Morn on a toy piano. We thought it magical. The second year, we laughed behind our hands at the odd man. And the third year, we didn't even go. So what's the point? That maybe your cunny isn't quite the draw you think it is. <laughs> <laughs> I quit. <laughs> Do I wait for Mr. Thompson? Oh, uh, he will call. Is he nice to you, Mr. Kessler? Okay. Yes, he is nice. Mr. Thompson is a very nice man. Are you trying to sass me, you greasy cocksucker? <laughs> If you steal, I ain't took nothing. If you steal, Charles, 
From my men, you steal from me. I don't know what you're talking about. <sighs> Jesus Christ! What the fuck are you doing? He has learned how to knock. <laughs> I'm sure your mother's going to pocket that money. You don't really want to be in here all by yourself, do you? Oh, girl, he just lost a whore. Give him some time. You're looking for that one? She's gone. Where is she? Off drinking champagne, I wouldn't be surprised. She's out all hours. Expects me to watch over her brats. And she works for French people. And not four months a widow. He was a lovely man. Mr. Schroeder. He always brought us the day old crawlers. He was a lovely man. You live right next to her, or lived right next to her. You must have heard what he did. Is there anything else you can tell me? She's a whore. <laughs> Come on, search him. If the stunt you pulled, you don't trust me. I tell you this right now, I am packing heat. We all are. Now that wasn't the deal. I don't like this, Johnny. If I wanted to kill you, you wouldn't have made it through the front door. Capone is such a nervous little fellow. Let's just say the whole thing was an unfortunate series of misunderstandings. I'm sorry about the girl. Your mug. Liam, be nice to hear that from him. I told him to pick a whore and he did. In order so I could make my point. And you did? And it's done? Over. Jimmy's not done with it. There's some good joints there, real busy. You should make a decent buck. The rest of the Delta. What the fuck? Nobody fucking move. It's a knife. So you, you searched him. Searched him. <laughs> you sneak a blade into a meat? Sneak? You searched him. <laughs> What's this? It's called a skull crusher. It's for cracking walnuts. <laughs> I crack a few with it, let you know. How about we crack your walnut, huh? The big one on your shoulders. I'm gonna visit the head. I'll bring the car around. Thanks, sweetie. Here's for you. What happened to the blonde? She's on coffee break. Mm -hmm. What's going on here? Thank you. <laughs> I think you'd agree the Greek town belongs to us now. Should have used your knife. Crack that nut. <laughs> so Capone acting nervous was just a charade, huh? The balls on his neck. <laughs> I'd just like to say that Jimmy Domity's a stand-up guy. When he ain't on the floor pissing himself, that is. He's over there in France. And I heard there wasn't one patty that could scrub a latrine whiter than our Jimmy. <laughs> Little Jettis prick. Not like you, huh? Captain Capone, hand-to-hand -hand with the Kaiser himself. <laughs> Unlike some of us, I don't need to brag about what I did. <laughs> the Lost Battalion. He got so lost he thought Brooklyn was in France. <laughs> that stuff you said in front of the boys about me in the war makes me look bad. You started it. Oh, what an asshole. I love babies. I sit for most of the other young ladies, too. Other young ladies? Us girls all help each other out here. Which girls? Me, you know. The concubines. <laughs> so I just called. He's all hot and bothered. I didn't have time to make arrangements. <laughs> How many women does Nucky have? <laughs> the shit. I'm not sure if he tries to punish himself or if he gets off like this. Ah. Ah. 